2016 has been quite an interesting year to say the least. But while the political world has been a hive of controversy and the celebrity world has lost its fair share of bright stars, the world of hi-fi and AV has never looked stronger. From the launch of 4K Blu-ray to a real consumer breakthrough for OLED, 2016 has had lots to offer, with plenty of five-star products jostling for a place on your audition list. We've picked just 10 of our favorites, all of which have stood out particularly well in their categories. So in no particular order, let's take a look at what they are. First up is the Dali Catch, a superb portable speaker that trumps a whole host of big name competitors by delivering top notch sound quality in a smart and portable package. USB and 3.5 millimeter inputs back up the stable Aptex Bluetooth connection and its battery life won't leave you short either, with two hours of charge giving you a whole 24 hours of playback. Most impressive though is how good the catch sounds. Not only is it capable of delivering a sound that's full of more weight and punch than its size would suggest, but it's also keen with fine detail scale and dynamics too. It might not be the cheapest portable speaker on the market, but you'll do well to find one better. Next up is the AudioQuest Dragonfly Red, the latest version of the small USB stick sized DAC and headphone amp that has been wowing us since 2012 with a difference such a small thing can make to the sound of our music. Costing almost double the price of the regular black version at £170, it has a lot to prove, but it does so convincingly. With a number of internal upgrades plus a higher output voltage for driving more demanding headphones, the improvement in sound is considerable. It's noticeably fuller bodied and there's more detail, while better lower level dynamics show a subtler, more expressive character, no matter what you're playing. It certainly makes a strong case for making the upgrade, offering all the things we love from the black version and then some. Sony made its entry into the wireless noise cancelling headphone market this year with the MDR-1000X stepping up to a competitive marketplace with real confidence. A smart and comfortable pair of headphones, they come with one or two tricks up their sleeve, including touch controls on the right ear cup and ambient sound settings for fine tuning just how quiet you want it to be. They're easily on par with the Bose QC35s when it comes to blocking out the outside world and better than the more expensive Momentum Wireless. Most importantly though, they sound great too, delivering a bold but refined sound that's crisp and precise with lashings of detail at every turn. It's a superb listen, making them a complete package that gives the usually comfortable competition something to consider. In fact, we think they're a serious contender for best in class. Riga's Planner 3 decks have dominated their market sector ever since the original was launched in the late 1970s. To date, the generational changes have been fairly steady, but the shift from Riga's RP3 to the new Planner 3 is huge. Just about every part has been revised to give a proper jump up in sound quality, and the result is a considerably cleaner and clearer sound than its talented predecessor. There's greater transparency here and more resolution of detail too, but most importantly, that engaging Planner 3 musical character hasn't been diluted. If anything, this new version is even more fun. With extra servings of clarity, precision, and insight added to an already musical sound, the new Planner 3 is the best value record deck on the market. If you wanted a list of best speakers under £200, for most of this year it would have been a shortlist comprising just a single name, the Q Acoustics 3020. But the Mission LX2s have knocked those talented speakers off their perch with an enthusiastic performance that makes their £160 price tag seem like a bit of a bargain. We'll forgive their more functional design for how they sound. Play any song and these speakers get right to the heart of the music, dishing out expression as if they know exactly what the musicians wanted you to feel. They pack a serious punch for their size too and they deliver deep bass with precision and authority while always remaining quick on their feet. Expect nuance and organisation no matter what you're playing. You'll need to be a little careful with partnering, but get it right and these will entertain you with every listen. The £500 AV receiver market is a seriously competitive one, but Denon has showed that you don't always need a revolution to impress. Especially if, like the AVR X2300 Home Cinema Amp, you're able to expertly refine it at the same time as ramping up the features. Your £500 buys you a list of functionality as long as your arm and joins a superb multi-channel performance that leaves the competition floundering. This is an amp that's just at home with the subtleties of a movie soundtrack as it is the big action scenes, one that's capable of delivering barely their details or a full-on assault with equal ability. Even if it's short of a little out-and-out -out muscle, the 2300's authority is absolutely unarguable. Even in the most understated scenes, the Danon exhibits a masterclass of grip and control. Whether you're starting your system or improving it, this AV receiver should be top of your audition list. If you're on the lookout for a hi-fi streamer, this year's Cambridge Audio as your 851N ticks every box. Expect DSD support and 24-bit 192kHz playback across all its inputs, alongside internet radio, Spotify Connect and Apple AirPlay. 
You won't be left wanting for physical connections either, and it can double up as a pre-amplifier too. No matter how you choose to listen, the 851N offers class-leading insight, ensuring that bass is punchy, the mid-range is clear and articulate, and the treble has plenty of bite. It ensures there's never a dull moment, no matter what you're playing. It's the ideal high-end streamer, offering a combination of connectivity, functionality, and performance that simply can't be beaten, and we love it. Astle & Kern's AK70 is the company's most recent punt at the more affordable end of the portable music player market, offering compatibility with high-res music up to 192kHz and DSD formats too. There's a built-in microSD card slot for expanding the internal 64 gig of storage, plus onboard Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. But most interesting is the fact that the AK70 doubles up as a digital to analog converter to be used with your computer, a first for an Aston and Kern player. Not just that, but it's a stunning performer too. Thanks to its tonal balance, open and effortless musical nature, and ability to reach ear-shattering volumes, the AK70 delivers an all-round impressive performance that'll have you stripping your smartphone of any music duties. Combine this with class-leading features and a super Superb design, and the AK70 is the most sophisticated high res music player you can buy for under £500. 2016 has been the year that 4K has really started to make sense for consumers, and the launch of 4K Blu ray and the first 4K players has played no small part in that. Panasonic's DMP UB900 was the first of them all and set the bar high. So high, in fact, it's yet to be bested. Alongside a solid design and excellent connectivity, its picture quality wipes the floor with its competitors. Detail levels are outstanding, leaving Blu-ray for dust with a natural but vivid color palette that will really make the most of any HDR content you throw at it. It has a strong upscaler too, so you won't need to worry about your stash of regular Blu-rays becoming obsolete just yet. 4K in the home has well and truly arrived, and the Panasonic UB900 makes the most of every single pixel. Finally, and while many manufacturers have shelved the idea of OLED due to its rather prohibitive cost, LG has been one brand that has ploughed on with the technology, and we have to say we're very happy that it has. It only takes one look at the picture performance of the LG OLED 65E6 to put its somewhat eye-watering price into perspective. Pictures are immediately eye-grabbing, filled with a level of detail and precision that's rare, even for a 4K HDR TV. Colours are striking too, with reproduction that seems to be as punchy and enthusiastic as possible without compromising realism. Of course, black levels are second to none, and contrast is outstanding. Plus, this set even sounds good, with a built-in soundbar stand that offers an improvement in both insight and volume over standard flat-screen TV speakers. LG has been at the vanguard of TV technology for the past few years with its OLED panels, and this set shows off the technology's abilities at their finest. We can't wait to see what's in store for it in 2017. So, did you spot any of your kit in our list? Let us know in the comments below, and for more reviews of 2016's finest products, head over to whathifi.com. If you want to get in contact, you can get us on all of the social media channels. You can like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, or add us on Google+.